Okay, shall we start? Good morning. Are you happy? Okay, this is a very good class God has given us once again. Uh, gen general history of Christianity. Okay. General history of Christianity. The second chapter we have today. Hmm. The second chapter, general history of Christianity. <clears throat> Shall we pray? Our Heavenly Father, once again we thank you for this morning and the new day, new class, new subject. Thank you for giving us this type of newness in our knowledge. Father, we, we request your presence here and your teaching here, your, your voice here. Please help us to know many things. Bless all of us with the knowledge in Jesus' holy name we pray. Amen. You see, <clears throat> we are in the general history of Christianity. In that, in our last class, we've seen chapter 1, the beginnings. That's the chapter name, the beginnings. And today we go into the second chapter, <clears throat> the house church. Okay, chapter number two, the the house church. That's our second chapter for today. We will see second second chapter and and will be done for today. Okay, the first house church was in Jerusalem. Okay, the first church was in Jerusalem. Uh, three great events in the early history of Christianity took place in Jerusalem house. There was a house in Jerusalem. Three great events took place in that house, a house of Jerusalem. Number one, the Lord's Supper. The Lord's Supper. We see Mark chapter 14, verses from 12 to 26. Mark chapter 14, verse from 12 to 26. The house church. Gruha mandiralu, gruha devalayalu. Gruhamandralu, Gruhadevalayalu, the house church, the house churches. Now the question is, whose house and where? Okay, that's the question. We say, I, I told you a house in Jerusalem, but whose house and then where? When I, when, I, when I question where, the answer is Jerusalem. But whose house? You know, we, we're going to see that now. Groha Devalayu, Groha Mandiram, Intlone, Intinta Kudu Kunidan Rasul together, Apostle Kariello. Have you seen that? You know that, right? Yeah. So, when you shake your head like this, I'm happy. I said, that means you know it, right? <laughs> okay. Yeah, so you're aware of it. So, anyway, Groha Devalayal, Groha Mandiral and it went, Intinta Kudu Kunutan Edi. Mother set up the Loman Gamanchin at twenty Vishu. Mother T. Gurha Ali, Gurha Mandar, Mother to the Akadan Terushilem Lo. Yerushalem Prantolondi Akada Mudu Pramukim and Vishal Jerigay, Mudu Gopo Vishal Jerigay. I intlo Mother to the Intente Prabhura Tribojanam Prabhu Balla, the Lord's Supper Prabhu Balla. Mark Swartha Padnalva Demo, Panin Nunchirway Arvarku, Mark Swartha Padnalvu, Panin Nunchirway Arvarku. That's the first the first thing, first event, great event, took 
took place in the house at Jerusalem. Second one is, you know, the appearances of Jesus to the apostles after his resurrection. Right? The appearances of Jesus to the disciples after his resurrection. I know Ponrod Dhanade Tirigilech in Tarvat, I know Ponrod Dhanade in Tarvata, Tana Sishula Kuchina Darsenam, Tana Sishula and the Ponrod Dhana Nantar Darsenam, Lu and Raskunta Chenamok Serpur, Ponrod Dhana Nantara, Ponrod Dhana Nantara Darsenam, Ponrod Dhana Nantara Darsenam. I know Ponrod Dhana Tarvata, Tana Sishula Gadiloni Darsenja, right? You remember that Jesus visited them. Appeared to the disciples in a room in a Jerusalem house. We see that in John chapter 20. John chapter 20, verse number 14 to 29. John 20, verses 14 to 29. Johan Swar Tervi Ode, Adnal Gununchi, Erve Tomidwar Konovachin, Albagoli Vishaman Chodgal, Vine, Darsinchin, the Tanasishuni, Gadilo, Var Gadilo Undaga. We have read that. As, as the doors were shut, he just suddenly came and appeared in front of them, in, in among them. And so his appearance took place in a house. And what's the third thing? You know that. The coming of the Holy Spirit. The coming of the Holy Spirit in Acts chapter 2. Parshuddha Atmuni. While they were still in the, in the room, in the house, Holy Spirit has come upon them. So these were the three great events took place in a Jerusalem house. Did you understand? Yeah. So this, th these were the very great events took place in the Jerusalem house. So... Mark chapter 4, verse number 14. Let's read that. Mark chapter 14, verse number 14. 14, 14. Mark chapter 14, verse number 14. Right. Vidhati Gadi, a guest room. Vidhidhika dente, guest room. Read in English. And where, and where so ever he shall go in, say ye to the good man of the house, the master said, where is the guest chamber? Right. You see the guest room, the guest house, guest chamber, all same. Jesus was telling, oh, you, you, you go after that man who is going with a pot, water pot, just follow him, wherever he goes, you, you go there. And when he enters into the house, you ask that how the good man in the house, where is the house for Jesus? And he will lead you. Then you go there to that house and prepare for Lord's table or for our meeting. Special house, a guest house. Vididikadi, Atan Venakal Villa, Atan Ekra Kelta, Intlo Kelta, Atan Villa Tarvata, A Intlo Nejmandar Kelly, Prabhu Korku. Yedi, Mr. Yegadiman, Yakar said the Parchkola and Aditha, Walchip Taru, Akarkil, Mr. the Parchandi. So they know my guest house. People know my guest house. So we see a guest room here. Read verse number 15. And he will show you a last upper room, furnished and prepared. There are made ready for us. See? Telugu? Already prepared room, okay? आ सामाग्रितो सिद्ध परच्छ बढ़ी ना अब गौपा मेड़ गए थे हाँ right okay you see he sent two disciples so go with him and then prepare a place in an upper room so that should be our guest room 
So, where did people gather in the beginning in the first century? In the houses. People used to gather in the houses for a meeting. They used to meet, discuss about God, eat, enjoy, marry, do things in the, upper, in the room. So, house churches. So, started in Jerusalem. And then when we see Acts chapter 1 verse number 2, because they were on the upper room, right? Yeah, Acts chapter 1 verses 12 and 13, let's read. Acts chapter 1, 12 and 13. Hmm. Hmm. Jesus and disciples, they were living in a room, okay? They were living in one room, in the upper room. Yelati Gadan Rasundadi, Goppa Gadan Rasungada, in the Chadwin in the Chadina. Goppa, Goppa, Goppa Pradesh, Goppa Gadi. It's a big one, huh? It's a very big room. How can we say it's a very big room? Because 120 people gathered there with the disciples by the time the Holy Spirit has come upon them. You see that? 120 people could gather there together. Imagine how big was the house, a room. You see in our room 120 people will be sufficient? No, right? So if you say 120 people, then it's a big room. It's a large place, a very big room, 120 people. In verse number 15, you say there in verse number 15, hmm? see, Right. See, 120 people gathered in that upper room. You see, that's a very big room. So, Jesus and disciples had a very big room where they lived. Of course, that's not their own home. <laughs> they were living in a very big room. Well, when we go to Acts chapter 12, when we go to Acts chapter 12, we see Peter escaped from Roman prison. Strangely, Holy Spirit, our God has delivered him from Herod's prison, sorry, Herod's prison. He was, he was bound in a Herod's prison, Herod Yoka. Charasalo, Bandinch Bartadu, Apostle Karyal Pananda Devalo, Petru Garu. As Chirikaranga, they would in Akadunchi would pinch by this cost at Ratri Kratre. Akadin Chadutamante, Petru Garu Jail Nunchi Bait Gragane, Akadgala Latano Yakadgilte, Surakshatang on Tad Akadgala together. So I in Akadgilad and Rasunde, Pradan Jurki Pradeshani, direct kill paid. And then tells us that if our pradhan is done, do this Pradesh and quilt the pradhan is done. That you, man, we put the ekadai the pradhan will cover the court court. Now, mo, a house kill power will put. I nil pe tal put na pro chinnna papa, right? Rodya na oka chinnna papa chhi. Past karo chiran gatti kar sindi. Under pradhan lo chile so chapur peter ni swe karin chhi. You see, Peter knows. I mean, in chapter twelve, Peter knows. Where should he go when he was delivered from the Herod's prison? Herod has put him in the prison and in the midnight, God has helped him miraculously. He was out of the prison. And after he was delivered from the prison, he was you know, directly going to one place. He knows where all the church members, all the believers gather to pray. And so he knows the place of prayer and immediately he was going to that place. So he went there, Peter. How does he know the place? How does he know that every believers were there? Did anybody tell him? You see, because all the believers were praying for Peter. That's what the Bible says, right? 
believers were praying for Peter and Peter was delivered directly he has gone to the same place how does he know the address how does he know where all of them were gathering in you know for him for praying for him because that's the only place they used to gather all the times that's the place they gather all the time and that's why he knows that place and directly he went to that house the house churches the early in the first centuries the people used to gather you know bible says that's the house of mary mother of john mark right <clears throat> that's the house of mary the mother of john mark we're coming to the point now డైరెక్ట్ గా ఇంటికి వెళ్ళిపోయాడు కదా పేతురు గారు ఎందుకంటే అక్కడ ప్రార్థనలు జరుగుతాయని ఆయనకి తెలుసు నిత్యము ప్రార్థనలు జరిగే ప్రదేశం అది అని ఆయనకి తెలుసు అందుకే డైరెక్ట్ గా వెళ్ళడం అక్కడికి వెళ్ళిపోయాడు ఆయన ఆ ఇల్లు ఎవరిదని రాస్తుందంటే బైబిల్లో యోహాను మార్కు మార్కు అను మారు పేరు గల యోహాను రైట్ మార్కు అను మారు పేరు గల యోహాను యొక్క తల్లి అయిన మరియ ఇంటికి వెళ్ళాడు అక్కడ జరుగుతుంది ప్రార్థన రైట్ సీ దేర్ దేర్ పీపుల్ యూస్ టు గ్యాదర్ ఫర్ ప్రేయర్ ఓవర్ దేర్ దట్స్ ద ప్లేస్ ఆఫ్ ప్రేయర్ ఇన్ జెరూస్లెమ్ సో వేర్ డూ పీపుల్ గ్యా వేర్ డిడ్ పీపుల్ గ్యాదర్ ఫర్ ప్రేయర్ ఇన్ ద ఫస్ట్ సెంచరీ ఇన్ అ హౌస్ ద హౌస్ ఆఫ్ హూ మేరీ ద మదర్ ఆఫ్ జాన్ మార్క్ so that house have been the place of meeting for the first congregation of christ church the first of the house churches gruha devalayallo motta matra gruha devalayam jerusalem lo maria intlo యోహాను మార్కు యోహాన్ అనబడినటువంటి వాణి యొక్క కుటుంబంలో సో డిడ్ యూ అండర్స్టాండ్ రైట్ ఓకే యూ అండర్స్టూ రైట్ యా వీ ఆల్సో హ్యావ్ వన్ హౌస్ చర్చ్ ఇన్ ఫిలిపాయ్ వీ ఆల్సో హ్యావ్ వన్ చర్చ్ ఇన్ కోరింత్ వీ హ్యావ్ వన్ చర్చ్ హౌస్ చర్చ్ ఇన్ రోమ్ వీ హ్యావ్ వన్ హౌస్ చర్చ్ ఇన్ ఎఫ్ఎస్ఎస్ వీ హ్యావ్ వన్ హౌస్ చర్చ్ ఇన్ లావడేషియా we have one church in kolasai you know where who is there in kolasai remember philemon philemon onesimus philemon right that's in kolasai i told you philemon yokka grahame ekkada unde kolasi philemon telusu kada athana saaru athana saavukudaina onesimus paulu idantha meeku telusu right so call us i so we have one that's the house actually when we studied the new testament survey i have explained it to you saying people used to gather for prayer in the house of philemon so that's there in in colossae that's also one of the house churches so most probably these churches are the homes of women probably the homes of uh, widows they were single so their houses are empty having place for meeting so these were the only churches right house churches were the only churches for christians in the first century and also most of the second century first century and most of the second century they, those were the only places and there's a place called edessa 180 i'm talking about in 180 in 180 ad 180 we have a 
we have a place called Edessa. It's in Arbil. This is a big, it's a place named Arbil. In that place, after 180, the king of Edessa became a Christian. Okay, the king of Edessa became a Christian and uh, when people were searching for the research, they found this. They found this and slowly um, they, the building was destroyed by flood in 201. In 201 there had been a flood and in that flood the, the building was destroyed. King of Edessa, he has built a, a nice house church. But we don't have it now because in, in 201, it was destroyed in a flood. When archaeologists, when archaeologists uh, made their findings and researches, we found several things. Edessa and Prantolo are built and I pranto lo edessa raju madhusariga o kristavudu ainappudu atane ekka grahamlo house church anedi okati airport cheyadam jarigindi 2101 lo flood varada varada valla avanni nashanam ayipoyadu Okay, during the Roman Empire, people continued in the house churches. Okay, during Roman Empire, because they encouraged it, it's okay, they said. Remember, other religions have their temples, but Jews had their synagogues. Remember that, okay? Other religions had their temples, Jews had their synagogues, but Christians? Okay, so other religions had their temples, Jews had their synagogues, but Christians were something new. <laughs> Christians were something new. They used to meet in a house church. Itar matastulaku devalayalunai yudla kemo. Samaj Mandra Lunai, Sinagoglu, Christ Tolkemo, Groha Devalayal, Intintanu, Kurkonuchu, and the Walchis in Pani. What was the, you know, what was the first Christian property? Okay, what was the first Christian property? Because this is, this is a, you know, house church is not a property, right? It's, a, it's an individual property, not for the church. So what, what's the first Christian, I mean, first church property? You know what? <laughs> grave. Gravelands. G-R-A-V-E. Grave. What is grave means? Samadhu. Samadhul Doddi. Samadhul Thota and Tarkondamandi. Samadhul Stalam. Christol Yoka. Matamadati Asti. Pala Pirmeduna Matamadati Asti. That's the first property the church has ever had. <laughs> they did not have even a church building as church property. They were, they were actually thinking about the place for Christians to bury their bodies. Let's not throw bodies and let's not burn the bodies. Let's bury. Man has come out of the dust and to the dust he shall return. And so since he has come from the dust, let's put him in the dust. Manavudu, manti nunchi tīpa daduganaka marla tīrigi mannai pōvunu ani devudu cheppadu. 
కాబట్టి మనం కాల్చొద్దు పడేయొద్దు జంతువులకో క్రూర జీవులకో వేసేయొద్దు మరి ఏం చేయాలి తిరిగి మంటికే తీసుకెళ్ళిపోదాం మంటి నుంచి తీయబడ్డాడు కనుక మంటికే మరలా తీసుకెళ్ళిపోదాం సో లెట్స్ బర్డ్ ద లెట్స్ డిగ్ ద గ్రౌండ్ మేక్ ద పిట్ సఫిషియంట్ ఫర్ ద బాడీ అండ్ దెన్ పుట్ హిమ్ ఇన్ సైడ్ కవర్ ఇట్ విత్ ద మర్డ్ అగైన్ అండ్ దెన్ మేక్ ఇట్ యాజ్ అ టూంబ్ సో గ్రేవ్ ఏమంటాం దాన్ని మనం గ్రేవ్ అంటాం మనం మామూలుగా గ్రేవ్ అని దేని అంటాం కూరలో ఉన్న ఊర్పుని గ్రేవ్ అంటాం కదా కొంచెం గ్రేవీ గ్రేవీ ఇదేంటి గ్రేవ్ సో దిస్ ఈజ్ ద ప్లేస్ ఆఫ్ డెడ్ బాడీస్ బరియల్ సొసైటీ ఓ లెట్స్ కాల్ ఇట్ బరియల్ గ్రౌండ్ యా దట్స్ ద దట్స్ ద ఫస్ట్ ప్లేస్ క్రిస్టియన్స్ హ్యావ్ యాజ్ దేర్ ప్రాపర్టీ ఆర్కియాలజిస్ట్స్ ఫౌండ్ వన్ ప్లేస్ ఓకే భూమిని భూమిని త్రవ్వి రీసెర్చ్ చేసేవాళ్ళు ఉంటారు కదా వాళ్ళని ఆర్కియాలజిస్టులు అంటారు సో వాళ్ళు భూ భూమిని తవ్వి ఆ త్రవ్వకాల్లో ఒక ప్లే ఒక ప్లేస్ని వారు కనుగొన్నారు రోమన్ రోమన్ ప్లేస్ రోమన్ ఫోర్ట్రెస్ ఒకటి వాళ్ళు వెతికారు నైన్టీన్ థర్టీ ఫోర్లో పంతొమ్మిది వందల ముప్పై నాలుగులో వాళ్ళు ఆ ప్రదేశాన్ని కనుగొ దే 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 ఫౌండ్ అ ప్లేస్ అండ్ దే వెన్ దే స్టడీడ్ వెన్ దే రీసెర్చ్ ఆన్ ఇట్ దే దే అండర్స్టూడ్ దిస్ వాజ్ అ హౌస్ చర్చ్ దిస్ వాజ్ అ హౌస్ చర్చ్ సో దే కాల్డ్ ఇట్ యాజ్ డ్యూరా యూరోపస్ అ డ్యూరా యూరోపస్ ఆ ప్రదేశానికి వాళ్ళు ఈ పేరు పెట్టి డూరా యూరోపస్ అనే పేరు పెట్టి ఇది ఆ కాలంలో ఉండినటువంటి ఒక హౌస్ చర్చ్ ఇది గృహ దేవాలయం అని వాళ్ళు దాన్ని గుర్తుపట్టారు పంతొమ్మిది వందల ముప్పై నాలుగులో how 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 do we how do we identify that this is a house church idi house church an manaku ela ardham ayyadi okay valaku dorikindi they found it they research and they found it. how how do you know that this is a house church how could they recognize it is a how how could they recognize it as a house church dorikindi sare vetikaru dorikindo place kanu ide house church ani grah devalayam ani din ela gurtu padtaru vallu you know there were some signs there were some symbols to identify it as a house church there was an altar okay like this there was an altar oka balpetam lantadu undi nilabadi devunu vakyam pettukoni chadukoni ilanti oka balpetam undi tarvata baptism icche tante oka pradesham undi akade andulone ఓకే మధ్యలో ఉన్న ఒక గోడ పడేసి రూమ్ని విశాలంగా చేసిన ఆధారాలు ఉన్నాయి మధ్యలో గోడ పడేసిన ఆధారాలు గుర్తులు ఉన్నాయి బాప్తిసం ఇచ్చినటువంటి దానికి సంబంధించిన బొమ్మలు గోడల మీద వేసి ఉన్నాయి ప్రజలకు బాప్తిస్ అలివ్వడం లాంటి బొమ్మలు గోడల మీద వేసి ఉండటం
కేశయ్య గుడ్డివాని కళ్ళు గుడ్డివాని పట్టుకుని వాని కళ్ళ మీద చేతులు పెట్టి వాని కన్నులు తెరిచినటువంటి ఆ బొమ్మల గుర్తులు బాప్తీసాన్ని గుర్తుగా ఉపయోగించేవారు అప్పట్లో కళ్ళు తెరవబడిన వినికి అని అర్థం వచ్చేలాగా ఏ సుప్రభు గుడ్డివాని కళ్ళు తెరిచినట్టుగా దాన్ని ఒక గుర్తుగా you see this picture here the the first one okay the first one people used this type of symbol to tell the meaning to the people you know that this is the place of baptism he was baptized that means his eyes were opened so that's the symbol people used so we found this picture on the wall and we understood that this is a place of baptism so when we have the pictures and when we have the place of baptism and then when we have the altar what does it it called right what can we call it as a house church that's how people archaeologists identified it as a house church inni aadharalu chusin tarvata vaallaku appudu ardham ayindi idi griha devalayam ga prajalu vaadukonina pradesham very beautiful 1934 by the way you all have to buy this textbook okay all of you have to contribute 150 rupees 150 150 rupees by this textbook we are going to use this as a textbook in the classroom i'm going to explain from here every time so how many things you can write down if you have the textbooks you can just underline and then if there is anything extra information you can just write down let's do that 150 yeah and those who want you just tell me give me your name we'll order those books you can buy it <clears throat> now there people found some pictures on the walls like a good shepherd bringing a sheep good shepherd bringing a sheep like a healed paralytic man jesus bringing the peter into the boat from the water picks peter from the water and then bringing him into the boat you know that that type of pictures painted on the wall to make people understand this is a place of worshiping the lord jesus oka gorrela kaapari gorrena bhujam meda esukoni teskuntunnatuga teppipoyina gorrena vediki techukuntunnatuga pakshavayu galavadu baagu parchabadnatuga tarvata neetlo munigi potunna petru cheyi pattukuna atani levanetti malli naav daggariki teeskoni vastunnatuga ilanti bommalu గోడల మీద వేసి అలా చేయడం ద్వారా ఇదే ఆ ప్రభువును ఆరాధించుకునే స్థలం అని ప్రజలకు అర్థమయ్యేలాగా వాళ్ళు అప్పట్లో దాన్ని చేసేవారు సో ఆ గుర్తులన్నీ మనం చూసినప్పుడు యూనో బై వెన్ వీ లుక్ వెన్ వీ లుక్ ఎట్ ఆల్ దీస్ పిక్చర్స్ అండ్ వీ అండర్స్టాండ్ దిస్ ఈజ్ ఎ ప్లేస్ ఆఫ్ ప్రేయర్ దిస్ ఎ ప్లేస్ ఆఫ్ వర్షిప్ హౌస్ చర్చ్ సో వీ డోంట్ హ్యావ్ అ సపరేట్ చర్చ్ బిల్డింగ్ ఎట్ దాట్ టైమ్ రైట్ యా వీ డోంట్ హ్యావ్ now now what happened in the house church that's the question right the first thing that we have said whose house and where adi evari illu ekkada anedi ippudu dakku manam chusam evari illadi whose house was that the house of mary the mother of john mark where is it where was it in jerusalem so whose house and where that's what we've seen now now let's go to what happened in the house 
in the house church. What happened in the house church? Akada in Jerigidi, Akada Jerigina twenty Karikrama Lenti, if you got a Manukyapun Jeskoval. Okay, what happened in the house church? Actually, we were talking about good things about the church, right? So far. <laughs> so far, we were talking about good things about the church. Because people used to gather and then Peter delivered and came to the same house. We were talking about good things only so far. We will come to the difficult part of the church. This is a general history of the Christianity. So, we come to the the part of persecution slowly but at this time we don't have much persecution not much of course so the disciples were martyred for Christ's sake but we have we, ha we have more things in the future future to this point and so right now we, we, we are seeing only the good things you know yeah things are going to be worse in the, in the later, later chapters they also had uh, problems, failures, mistakes, divisions in the churches. We are going to see them. Now what has happened, okay? What happened in the house church? Number one, baptism. Mother Denti, Baptist from Injurigin Dakkada house church. Number two, Sunday worship. Adivarapu, Aradhana. And number three, Preaching. Number three, preaching. Parthamanamu. Number four, Eucharist. Number four, Eucharist. Momo would understand better, I think. The term Eucharist. Okay, number four, Eucharist. Five, Eucharist and Raskun Telukoda. Prabhu Balla, but Eucharist and Raskun Telukoda. Padam Gutundal. Five, church discipline. Church discipline, Sangha Kram section, Akre, Jarigedi, House Church Lone. Sangha Kram section, Yala, rules and regulations, Chapra Mata. Church discipline and six meeting the needs of poor people. Meeting the needs of poor people. Irupadalak Sahai Padam. Irupadalak Sahai. Ah, it is the Eva Sahai and Kadu. Sanga Sahai. Okay. <coughs> And seventh one, death and burial. Death and burial. Maranalu, Samadhi Karikramal. House church and Agani, even is a good one day. Is a real good one. We fought, we have worked out for burial ground, and then church is the one which is supposed to do that work. After getting the land, what is the use if we don't use it, right? And so, that's also one more work the church, I mean, the house church used to do. And eighth one, teaching about prayer. Teaching about prayer. Pradhan Gurinchana 20, Bodalu. Pradhan Gurinchana Bodalu. And nine, and nine, Easter, Easter, mm. Pentecost, sorry, you're right.
epiphany christmas you see these things happened in the first in those house churches all together nine right yeah let's go to the first thing baptism the first thing was baptism do you know the name tertullian you heard the name in theology uh, tertullian t e r t u l l i a n tertullian you know who he was he was a roman lawyer okay nyayavadi he was a roman lawyer born in a place called carthage in africa he was a roman lawyer born in a place called carthage tertullian ane manushi gurinchi cheptunnan tertullian ane manushi roma lo atadu nyayavadi carthage ane place lo adi africa lo undi carthage ane place lo atanu janminchadu and he became a christian in 195 195 lo atanu christavudu ayyadu a very skillful man okay he was called as christian teacher and he was a writer tertullian atadu kristava prabodakudu tarvata oka rachayita pustakalu rastu unde vadu enduku ayina gurinchi cheptunnan ante he told about the baptism in the first century okay he told about you know great show nothing new no expense that's what he told about baptism what did he say no great show nothing new no expense pedda show emi kaadu dantlo edo eppudu chodani vishayalu emi kaadu kharchul tho koodinde emi kaadu baptism ala cheppadu ayina tertullian baptism gurinchi and he explained it uh, man is dipped in the water few words will be said by the pastor and he comes out of the water and he is clean and his death is washed away this is a sign of the belief okay these are the these are the things actually tertullian a roman lawyer spoke about baptism and tertullian also introduced one word Greek word, ichthus. Ichthus. We call it as ichthus. This is a Greek word actually, you see. Ichthus. This way. Okay. So, he has used one Greek word, ichthus. as a sign among christians as a sign among christians christavuliki unna gurtu tertullian ane vyakti christavuliki oka gurtu pettadu enta gurtu ichthus you know what is the meaning fish fish ichthus means fish in english so that's the meaning kristavulu oka gurtu pettadu entadi ichthus ante fish chapa so that's the that's the symbol for a christian 
what did jesus say i will make you fishers of man so you going to you you going to catch fish you christians are fishermen <clears throat> and so so tertullian he he brought one idea for a christian sign he said ichthus is a good term because we are the fishers of men and so when you see the old and old christian ornaments like a, a chain around your neck fish symbol and then the rings fish symbol on the ring and then in the graveyard upon the tomb fish picture this is how the olden the olden christians used the symbol of fish as a christian symbol ha huh? appatlo dandalu vesku medalo dandalu vesukunte aa dandalo dandaki fish symbol unde laga chaapu gurtu unde laga ring pettukunte aa ring meeda chaapu gurtu tho unna ring samadhi meeda edaina kristavudu ane bomm eyalante chaapu gurtu ho idi kristavudu samadhi anamata ani telise laga adhamainda so this is how uh, the ancient christians used the fish symbol to say that they were christians <laughs> okay that's about baptism what's the second one sorry sunday worship okay the second one is sunday worship all all the believers used to gather on sunday prati christavudu kuda aadivaramana devun mandirlo kalusukone varu they read about the gospels not exactly written but you know not, not like a book form that we have and they used to read the writings of the prophets you know that all major and minor prophets as as long as they have time they used to read it and when the reading is finished the preacher would make a sermon and then all would stand and pray and then finished that's what we follow today also right ఏం జరిగేది అక్కడ సండే వర్షిప్ అంటే స్వార్థల గురించి చదివేవారు ప్రవక్తల స ప్రవక్తల గ్రంథపు చుట్టలు చదివేవారు ఎంత సమయం ఉంటే అంత సమయం చదువుకునేవారు చక్కగా ఎక్కువసేపు సేవకుడు లేచి కొన్ని మాటలు చెప్పేవాడు అందరూ లేచి నిలబడి ప్రార్థన చేసుకొని వెళ్ళిపోయేవారు సో దట్స్ హావ్ దట్స్ హావ్ దే దే హ్యాడ్ దేర్ సండే వర్షిప్ త్రీ థింగ్స్ దే డిడ్ రైట్ రీడింగ్ ఆఫ్ ద స్క్రిప్చర్ a sermon based on the reading and prayer okay these are the three things they used to do in the sunday worship reading of the scripture sermon based on the reading and prayers mood vishayalu jariginche varu vakya bhagani chadavadu chadivina vakya bhagam kanugunamaina vartamanam cheppadam prarthana chesukodu ee mood vishayalu jarigevi that's all about sunday worship what's the second what's the third one preaching right preaching that's the third one they used to do you know about irenius right i told you in a, while i was talking about new testament survey irenius okay i r e n a 
E U S I R E N A E U S Irenaeus You know he was a bishop okay he was a bishop Irenaeus was a bishop uh in a place called Gaul G A U L Gaul okay he was a bishop <coughs> Uh, today we call it a France, okay, France. So he was a bishop. He wrote, he wrote about the preaching of Bishop Polycarp. You remember I also talked about Polycarp? Yes. yes. When we talk about John the Apostle, we spoke about Polycarp, you remember? Yes. Yeah. ఈ ఐరేనియస్ అనేటువంటి బిషప్ గారు పాలికార్ప్ అనే మరి ఒక బిషప్ గారు చెప్పిన వాక్యాలని రాసేవాడు రాశాడు తన యొక్క పుస్తకంలో తాను రాసిన పుస్తకాల్లో దాని గురించి రాసేవాడు అంటే బిషప్ పాలికార్ప్ అనే వ్యక్తి ఎంత చక్కటి బోధకుడో ఎన్ని వాక్యాలు దేవుని గురించి చక్కగా ప్రజలకు వివరించేవాడో అర్థం చేసుకోవాలి ఐరేనియస్ అనే ఒక బిషప్పే పాలికార్ప్ అనే మరొక బిషప్ గారు రాసిన వాక్యాలను రాసేవాడు అంటే అతను ఎంత మంచిగా దేవుని వాక్యాన్ని ప్రకటించేవాడు పాలికార్ప్ అర్థం చేసుకోవాలి మనం యూసి ఐరేనియస్ వాజ్ అ బిషప్ అండ్ దెన్ హీ యూస్ టు రైట్ అబౌట్ ద ప్రీచింగ్స్ ఆఫ్ పాలికార్ప్ ద బిషప్ ఎస్ దెన్ యూ అండర్స్టాండ్ హౌ బ్యూటిఫుల్లీ పాలికార్ప్ యూస్ టు ఎక్స్ప్లెయిన్ అబౌట్ గాడ్ నా ద క్వశ్చన్ ఈజ్ హౌ కుడ్ పాలికార్ప్ నో to speak more about Jesus. Was he there during the time of Jesus? No. Right. You see, I have explained you and I have taught you New Testament survey. He has learned from John the Apostle and then from him, Irenaeus has learned and then from there other believers could learn. What we have learned there is coming now again. So it's a second time for you i think this this time it should be stamped in your mind <laughs> so polycarp gar rasina 20 devuniki sambandhinchina manchi vakyalanni irenius ane bishop garu ayana rasina pustakamlo rasevadu polycarp ki ippudu ekkada anta ekkuga ela devunu gurinchina vishayalu telusu ante nenu meeku new testament survey cheppinappudu teliyesanu polycarp శిష్యుడైన యోహాను అపోస్తలుడైన యోహానికి శిష్యుడైన డైరెక్ట్గా దేవుని శిష్యుల దగ్గర నుంచి నేర్చుకున్నాడు ఆయన యోహాన్ గారి దగ్గర ఖచ్చితంగా రైట్ ఉంటుంది అందులో ఎందుకంటే వాళ్ళు దేవుని దగ్గర నుంచి డైరెక్ట్గా నేర్చుకున్నారు వాళ్ళ దగ్గర నుంచి ఈయన డైరెక్ట్గా నేర్చుకున్నాడు అంటే యా హీఈస్ ఐ విట్నెస్ ఆఫ్ ద వర్డ్ ఆఫ్ లైఫ్ ఫ్రమ్ జాన్ ది అపాసల్ So the New Testament is what the eyewitnesses passed on. Tama kalla to chushana vallu siddha parachinde krotta ne bandana. Right? Tama kalla to chushana vallu chepkina twenty day krotta ne bandana. So the New Testament is what the eyewitnesses passed on to us. Uh, next one is Eucharist. Is that Eucharist? Okay, the next one is Eucharist. in another way we call it what lord's table lord's supper so this is the crown of sunday's worship <laughs> mm. this is the sign of sunday's worship i mean crown of sunday's worship this is a special program right it's a different it it looks different it 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 gives a beautiful sense of sitting in the presence of god because they commemorate the death burial and resurrection of jesus christ and take part in it people feel so good about it prabhu ballante ne adi yesu prabhu yokka marana punaruddhana marana samadhi punaruddhana karyakramalu drushtilo pettukoni shramalu drushtilo pettukoni teesukonedi kabatti okka rakamaina aatmiya bhavam prajallo oh idi man rakshakudiki sambandhinchina vishayam ani oka aatmiya bhavam prajallo undedi so aaradhana sunday worship antatlo kuda asalu ముఖ్యమైన ఆకర్షణీయమైన పని ఇదే అసలు అదే కిరీటం లాంటిది అని చెప్పారు అందుకే క్రౌన్ ఆఫ్ సండేస్ వర్షిప్ డీకన్స్ వుడ్ కమ్ ఫార్వర్డ్ ఎన్నెనో అండ్ ద డీకన్స్ విల్ టేక్ 
the bread and then the, the wine and then take to the uh, saved and baptized believers. Who used to do that? Who used to do? Deacons. Sangha Paracharakul. Sangha Paracharakul dhan chese wal. Wal mundu kochi dhan tisko ni. Viswasil andar ki panche varu. You know what is the beauty here? They used to distribute to the believers who are present here. And they used to take to the believers who are absent. That's the beauty, right? Oh, for us, those who come, they eat. Those who don't come, they, they, they lost. <laughs> you know, but in those days, the deacons would come and take this and give it to the believers who are here. And then they take to the believers who are not present in the church. Wow. Sangha Paracharakul Raudu, Vartis Koni, Krona Valandar Ki Panchi, Ekkar Lene Vari Kuratis Kele Valandar. So, Vokwali Illu Chala Dormai Tengeli. Eh? Viswas Illu Chala Dormai Tengeli. Alatame. Ah, such a beautiful practice. Why? Okay, that, that's really good. You know, deacons give the bread and wine to all who are present and take it to those who are absent. I was very happy when I read this. So this is called Eucharist. I told you to remember the word Eucharist. Eucharist ne padam gurthi petko manje pena adhe prabhu balla. Yeah, you, you, can, you can write it as Lord's table, but let's remember the term Eucharist. That's why I told you to write as Eucharist. Prabhupada and Rasa's coach, Eucharist is not going to be able to do it. Eucharist is not going to be able to do it. You know, rich people, they used to take directly, and poor people used to mix water with the wine, water with the wine, and then make it more wine, and then they used to serve. Then, what is the director? ఉపయోగించుకునేవారు use it but whatever it, it, it doesn't lose its sanctity right yeah neel kalpisnanth matrana prabhu balla lo upayoginchina aa draksha rasam ade ade paade podda evata adi devun devun raktaniki sadrushyanga pokonda potunda raktaniki sadrushyanga akonda potunda ledhu so this is how this is how we use uh, this is how the poor people <coughs> this is how the poor people used it in the olden days and the rich people used it in a different way. And now the, the, the next thing is a church discipline, right? Yeah. The next thing is a church discipline. The leader is the one who takes care of the discipline of the church. Okay. Leader in another word we call it bishop or pastor. They call it presbyter. They also call president. Okay, presbyter. P R E S B Y T E R. Presbyter. P R E S B Y T E R. Presbyter and Pilchevar. Bishop Anachu, Pastor Garanachu, Presbyter Anachu. So the presbyter was not appointed for money. The post cannot be bought with money, that position. He paid for it and then he took that position. No, it's not bought. It is actually because of the proved character. What character? Proved. A proven character. A proved as good people. So, he presbyter and a padavi. Saukadane ye padavi, double chi kunkuna deite kadu, double ki kunkola dinni. Mari, Athanioka, Athanioka pravartana, Sariena di ani, Rujuain tarvata, Athanaka padavi odomanedi, jerry. 
Is that good? Really good, right? So the church decided, the believers have decided, he among all of us is the best person to be in that position. He used to come and attend this house church and meeting, all the meetings and he is very faithful in singing and praying and preaching in attending and all things he is good. So his character was proven to be good and worthy to be in this position. So they have decided and appointed him. Pratisari Devan Mandra Manakunda attend out untadu, Pradhan Jastunta, Patla Patun, Prasangistuntadu, Prajal Premisun, Anni Vishalo Kudaitadu, Savkudan Taginavadu, and a Sangha Nerna in Chintarvata, Athadu Savkudga March Badam, and Edi Adinalo Jerry. That's the church discipline, and he, he takes care of the church discipline. And the next one is church and those who are in need, church helping the people who are in need. Church helping those who are in a need. Ade saha adhika sahaya ni sangho yitharla andhin chedi. Adi adhikoda manu gyaapun jeskunanga one of the points. Point number five or six or? Six or five? Six. Sixth one, yeah. Sixth one, helping those who are in need. So church used to help the people who are in need. How? How church used to, do the, do the church have any property? No, right? Church's only property was what? Burial ground, graveyard. Remember that. Church's only property was burial ground. Asamadula thought a matrame, Christolioka asked the Marutim, Lid Maratla, which in the Walaki Nel or Prajuk Sahai Pode Walata, Padawalk Sahai Pode Walta, Sahai Yala, Yala Chester Walu. You know, once in a month they used to give offering. Once in a month, what do you call it? In other words, once in a month, what do you call it? Tight, right? Tight. Dasam bhago. Apka nello oxari kalakche se dhanya manta ru. Dasam bhago, right? Right. Tight. Dasam bhago. Church used to give. The church members used to give tight once in a month, and they don't use that tight for eating and drinking and for festivals. You know that? They didn't use that for feasting and drinking and enjoying. But they used to help the poor, they used to help orphaned children, they used to help the old people. Some Christians were forcefully, some Christians were forcefully sent into the mines. Mines, you know, mines, right? They dig for gold and other precious stones. Christians were forcefully sent to the mines as a punishment. Oh, you are being a Christian. You should not be here among us. You should go into the mines. Forcefully, they used to send them into mines for working, to, to make them work or labor day and night as a punishment. And so who would support those Christians? Now in the olden days, the house churches used to help the Christians who were forcefully sent into the mines as a punishment. The, the, the money that they have received once in a month, they used to send to the Christians who were sent into the mines, right? M-I-N-E-S, mines. They were sent into the mines as punishment and these people used to help them. And some Christians were sent into the islands as an exile. Islands, right? I-S-L-A-N-D-A, John was the example. They, they, were, they, were, they were sent into the islands as punishment. Dvipalakkoda pampinji sevaru, punishment ga, Christovallu kandamandane. Mines lo pampinji sevaru, Christovallu, punishment laga. Miru Mirila Martin Ro Miru Christ Olga on Dani Witch Patlega Mimal Mines La Padaston Akra Mir Panjas Gratra and Pagalan Mines La Tauta Tauta on Dani Miralagan Alan to Walaki House Churchesu Sahai Podevi and the Manchalva, right? Tenadan Kragadanki and Jochi Dan Karikramal Prachek and Spenchi Kunda Dini Anatha Pilalaku Padawalaki Rudulaki 
ఇలా బలవంతంగా గవర్నమెంట్ ద్వారా పనిష్మెంట్ పొంది మైన్స్లోకి ఐలాండ్స్ ద్వీపాల్లోకి పంపివేయబడిన క్రైస్తవులందరికీ వీళ్ళు సహాయం చేసేవారు యునో వాట్ ఆల్ ద పీపుల్ యూస్ టు సే అట్ దట్ టైమ్ సి హౌ దీస్ క్రిస్టియన్స్ లవ్ వన్ అనదర్ ఎయ్ మ్యాన్ గ్లోరీ బీ టు గాడ్ the the people used to say see how these christians help each other love each other akkada unna 20 anni janalanta idi chusi these christians were really good they love each other you know this name julian hmm he was a roman emperor non christian roman emperor julian he was a anti christian roman emperor christolaku virodhi actually ga julian ane roma chakravarti in roma chakravarti in 362 362 lo christ chakra 362 lo he has spoke something about christians <laughs> he spoke something about christian you write down the christians feed <clears throat> the christians feed not only their own poor the christians feed not only their own poor but ours as well but ours o u r s <clears throat> but ours as well comma now no one in need now no one in need looks to the temples now no one in need looks to the temples ah i like this man roman emperor julius you know anti christian he was an anti christian he spoke good words about christians in 362 ad he said you know the christians feed not only their own poor they also feed our poor people that means the the, the help of the house church was not only for christians but for it's a, it's a general help for everybody ఏం చెప్పాడు జూలియస్ అని జూలియన్ జూలియన్ అనే జూలియన్ అనే ఈ ఈ రోమా చక్రవర్తి ఏం చెప్తున్నాడు అంటే ఈ క్రైస్తవులు తమలోని పేదవాళ్ళకి మాత్రమే కాకుండా మాలో ఉన్న పేదవాళ్ళకు కూడా సహాయపడుతున్నారు నవ్ దోస్ వర్ ఇన్ నీడ్ ఆర్ నాట్ లుకింగ్ ఇన్ టు ద టెంపుల్స్ ఎట్ ద టెంపుల్స్ సమస్యలో ఉన్న వాళ్ళంతా ఇప్పుడు దేవాలయాల వైపు చూడట్లేదని చెప్తున్నాడు ఆయన ఎంత గొప్ప విషయం క్రైస్తవులు వాళ్ళ పేదవాళ్ళకు మాత్రమే క్రైస్తవ పేదవాళ్ళకు మాత్రమే కాకుండా ఇతరులైన వాళ్ళల్లో పేదవాళ్ళకు కూడా సహాయపడుతున్నారు ఎంత సహాయపడుతున్నారంటే అవసరాల్లో ఉన్న వాళ్ళు దేవాలయాల వైపు చూడట్లేదు మరి ఎటు చూస్తున్నారు క్రైస్తవుల వైపు చూస్తున్నారు ఈ సీ ద ప్రైజ్ గాడ్ ఫర్ దాట్ you see they were in need but people were in need but they were not looking at the temples for the help or oh, they have many gods but they were not looking at their gods for their temples for help but they were looking at what christians what a what a glorious testimony vaala devalai vaip kaakunda christul vaip chustunnaru ippudu సహాయం కొరకు అంత ఎక్కువగా క్రైస్తవులు సహాయపడుతూ వచ్చేవారు ఎక్కడ నుండి హౌస్ చర్చ్ ఇట్స్ ఎ ఇట్స్ ఎ వెరీ స్మాల్ ఇన్కమ్ రైట్ హౌస్ చర్చ్ ఈజ్ అ వెరీ స్మాల్ ఇన్కమ్ ఓ వీ హ్యావ్ ఎ మెగ్ వీ హ్యావ్ మెగా చర్చెస్ టుడే మెగా చర్చెస్ టుడే బిగ్ బిగ్ చర్చెస్ బట్ ఇన్ దోస్ డేస్ ఇట్స్ ఓన్లీ హౌస్ చర్చ్ నాట్ మెనీ పీపుల్ ఫ్యూ గ్యాదర్ ఇన్ ఇన్ ద నేమ్ ఆఫ్ జీసస్ but from that income they used to help 
people in such a way that people don't even look at the temples for the needs and they look at a Christian and they share their problems with a Christian and then Christian is moved in his heart with the heart of Jesus Christ. It's okay, don't worry man, I'm going to help you. So, Devala Elvai Puda Chodan Anta Ekuga, Christ will walk Sahain Jesari Pudu, Yavarena, Badale Bandalonte, Gulu Kalakonda, Christ the Order Kuchu, all Samusil Panchkodo, Christ the Order Kuchu, all Samusil Panchkodo, Christ the Order Kuchu, don't worry, in the nickname Sahain Jastalani Chapro, Yalandi. So, the heathen kings speak like that. Non Christians and anti Christians can speak about it like, like Christians, then you understand how. People even don't look at the state for the help, okay? They look at Christians for the help. So, so much of social service Christians used to do from that small local church. Now, death and burial. Death and burial. <clears throat> death and burial. Okay, I told you the only property of Christians in those days, what? Burial ground. Yeah, that's the only property they used to have. So the death and burial matter, when it comes, then we see that we repeat those things again. They, they used to have one favorite figure. They used to have one favorite figure on, on their tombs. Okay. వాళ్ళ సమాధుల మీద ఒక సింబల్ ఏర్పాటు చేసుకునేవాళ్ళు అప్పట్లో సమాధుల మీద యు నో వాట్ వాజ్ దట్ సింబల్ గుడ్ షెపర్డ్ ఓకే లేటర్ ఆన్ గుడ్ గుడ్ షెప్ సమ్ సమ్ యా యూర్ రైట్ సమ్ 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 టూమ్స్ హ్యావ్ ద సింబల్ ఫిష్ టు షో దట్ ఇట్స్ ఎ క్రిస్టియన్ టూమ్ అండ్ దెన్ మెయిన్లీ అండ్ ఆఫ్ కోర్స్ ఇట్స్ నాట్ ఓన్లీ ఫర్ ద టూమ్స్ ఇట్స్ ఫర్ ద యు నో చైన్స్ around the neck and then for the rings that you have ornaments because well, that that's another case and sometimes on the clothes the fish symbol kind of you know but for the tombs especially they used to have one symbol a good shepherd bringing home the sheep on his shoulders you know the story in the bible right a good shepherd finding the hundred sheep keeping it on his shoulder and bringing it right samadhul meda vallu oka symbol pettevar oka gurtu pettevar idi kristovula samadhi ane gurtu gurtu korku samadhul meda oka oka bomma ni set chesevar enta bomma manchi kaapari tappipoyina okka gorre vandalo tappipoyina okka gorre ni vedaki dani bujam me desi migitha gorrel tho kalapadaniki teesukostadu chusara aa bomma ఒక ఒక కాపరి ఆయన భుజాల మీద గొర్రె ఏలాడేసుకుని పట్టుకొని మిగతా గొర్రెల దగ్గరికి తీసుకు వస్తున్నట్టుగా దట్స్ ద సింబల్ వాట్ డస్ ఇట్ మీన్ దాని అర్థం ఏంటి హీఈస్ బ్రింగింగ్ హీ షీప్ ఇన్ టు ద ఫ్లాక్ మిగతా గొర్రెలు అన్న దగ్గరికి ఆయన ఒక గొర్రెని తీసుకొస్తున్నాడు అంటే చనిపోయిన వాళ్ళు దోస్ వన్ హూ ఈస్ డెడ్ He is just added to the already saved sheep, the group of saved sheep preserved in, in the presence of God. With that symbol, they used to put this figure. This is a favorite figure on the tombs. That's a good one, right? <laughs> so, Chani Poyana Vala Andhra Marla Thirgi Tanayaka Gorilla Mandala Kaya Cherasthunadu Ane Gurtu Oche Laga. అది పెట్టుకునేవారు వాట్ ఈస్ టుడే సింబల్ ఆన్ ద క్రాస్ ఆన్ ద టూమ్స్ క్రాస్ ఆఫ్ క్రైస్ట్ సో వీ హ్యావ్ ద క్రాస్ ఆన్ ద సెమ్ ఆన్ ద టూమ్స్ దిస్ ఈస్ అ క్రిస్టియన్ టూమ్ చేంజ్ నా రైట్ ఇట్స్ చేంజ్ నా వై డూ వై డూ వీ వై డూ వీ వాక్ యాజ్ అ ప్రాసెషన్ యాజ్ వీ టేక్ డెడ్ బాడీ టు అ బరియల్ గ్రౌండ్ 
డెడ్ బాడీని సమాధి చేయడానికి తీసుకెళ్ళినప్పుడు ఎందుకు జనాలు వెనకాల వెళ్ళేది జనాలు అందరూ ఎందుకు వెళ్తారు వైడు దగ్గ దే ఫాలో ద డెడ్ బాడీ యాజ్ ఇఫ్ దే వర్ మూవింగ్ ఫ్రమ్ వన్ ప్లేస్ టు అనదర్ ప్లేస్ దే వర్ టేకింగ్ హిమ్ ఫ్రమ్ వన్ ప్లేస్ టు అనదర్ బికాస్ హీ వాజ్ మూవింగ్ ఫ్రమ్ వన్ ప్లేస్ టు అనదర్ ప్లేస్ షిఫ్టింగ్ టోటల్ హీస్ లైఫ్ హీ ఈస్ షిఫ్టింగ్ ఫ్రమ్ దిస్ ప్లేస్ టు దాట్ ప్లేస్ ద అనదర్ ప్లేస్ సో ఆల్ ద పీపుల్ వర్ జస్ట్ గోయింగ్ ఆఫ్టర్ హిమ్ అండ్ దెన్ సెండింగ్ హిమ్ టు దాట్ అనదర్ ప్లేస్ ఎందుకు చనిపోయిన సమాధి వెనకాల అందరు వెళ్తారు సమాధి దొడ్డుల వరకు అంటే చనిపోయిన వ్యక్తి ఒక ప్లేస్ నుంచి మరొక ప్లేస్కి షిఫ్ట్ అవుతున్నాడు తన మొత్తం మొత్తం లైఫ్ అంతా షిఫ్టింగ్ మొత్తం సామాన్లు మాత్రమే కాదు టోటల్ లైఫ్ అంతా షిఫ్ట్ అవుతున్నాడు ఒక ప్లేస్ నుంచి ఇంకో ప్లేస్కి అందుకే జనాలు అందరూ ఆయన వెనకాల వెళ్ళి సాగ నంపుతారనమాట సాగ నంపి బాయ్ బాయ్ చెప్పొస్తారు గో టు ది అదర్ ప్లేస్ దాట్ ఈస్ ప్రిపేర్డ్ ఫర్ యూ This is not your place. Anyway, we will come afterwards. <laughs> Now, this is your time. So, you go. You see, they, they just give send-off, a farewell, say bye-bye to the person who is leaving. And that's why they go as a procession. In the point of death and burial, we need to think about it. And that's why I'm just sharing with you. What's the next one? Teaching on how to pray. teaching on how to pray actually nowadays we don't have to talk about prayer yeah because we know many things about prayer the teachers preach on prayer and then students can also preach on prayer right yeah professors can pray teach on prayer and then even the student of the bible theology and also is able to preach on prayer because they know about prayer many things and so they used to teach on prayer how to pray when to pray what to pray for place of prayer you see all these things they used to they used to teach in the church in in the house church em nerpevar akada ela prarthinchali eppudu prarthinchali em an prarthinchali ekkada prarthinchali ee vishayalanni vallu nerputhu undevar akada the a place lo a teaching on how to pray number 1 how to pray number 2 when to pray number 3 what to pray and the number 5 number 4 place of prayer all these things they used to teach them you know how to pray right do you know how to pray yeah do you know how to pray so when you go for prayer you settle down your mind first yeah you settle down your mind first then only a good prayer comes to you settle down your mind first think that god is just there before you god is sitting before you just think that you're bowing down before the feet of jesus he is there and you're with him and then you set your mind there god is there i'm i'm, I'm in front of god then you pour all your things in at his feet that's how to pray and then you see by the way you do not pray alone right christ is praying with us now the second thing is when to pray when should we pray usually according to the jewish practices three times a day morning noon and evening or night three times if all of you have a habit of praying for three times a day is better it's not that we follow jewish people or anyone else but it's good to it's good to think about god for three times in a day sit right brother so three times in a day when we pray it is actually good we can do that in the sight of god so that's all about how to, when to pray that's all that's all about when to pray and that's all about you see we uh, how many times we can pray a day and when we come to the third thing so what to pray for what to pray for we can pray for ourselves we can pray for others we can give thanks we can pray for the rulers and government and other things see this is this is this is the reason i mean these are the people we can pray for now the point is shall we stand and pray or shall we kneel down and pray or shall we sit and pray 
in those days people used to stand and pray when they stand and pray they are attentive you understand not sitting and praying not even kneeling down and praying only when they have confessed their sins they used to kneel down and pray ఆ రోజులు ఎలా ప్రార్థించేవారు మనం నిలబడి ప్రార్థించాలా కూర్చొని ప్రార్థించాలా మోకరించి ప్రార్థించాలనే ప్రశ్న కూడా ఉండేది అప్పట్లోనే ఎలా ప్రార్థించాలంటే నిలబడి ప్రార్థించేవారు అప్పట్లో అందరూ ఎలా నిలబడి కూర్చొని ప్రా ప్రార్థించేది కాదు నేను మోకరించేది ఎప్పుడంటే వాళ్ళు పాపాలు ఒప్పుకున్నప్పుడు మాత్రమే మామూలు ప్రార్థనలు అప్పుడు వాళ్ళు ఏం చేసేవారు నిలబడి చేతులు ఇలా పైకెత్తి ప్రార్థించేవారు అయిపోయేదాకా ఎంతసేపు ప్రార్థిస్తే అంతసేపు ఎలా ఉండేవారు నిలబడి చేతులు రెండు పైకెత్తి ఎంతసేపు ఉండే అంతసేపు సో నువ్వు ఎంత ప్రార్థన చేసినా అయితే ఇలాగా లేకపోతే ఇలాగా లేకపోతే ఇలాగో మొత్తానికి నీ చేతులు నొప్పి కొంచెం దిగవచ్చు బట్ చేతులు మాత్రం ఆకాశం అయిపోయాయి ఆకాశం అయిపోయి టువర్డ్స్ గాడ్ హ్యాండ్స్ టువర్డ్స్ యూ స్టాండ్ అప్ అండ్ పుట్ యూ రీచ్ యూ హ్యాండ్స్ టువర్డ్స్ గాడ్ టువర్డ్స్ హెవెన్ అండ్ దెన్ ప్రే లైక్ దిస్ ఆల్ ద టైమ్ హౌ మెనీ టైమ్స్ యూ ప్రే హౌ లాంగ్ యూ ప్రే దిస్ ఈస్ ద సేమ్ పోస్టర్ దాట్స్ హౌ దే యూస్ టు టీచ్ దేర్ జస్ట్ లైక్ దిస్ and then pray how long you can you know what you will not sleep <laughs> am i right you pray like this you will not sleep you may be tired like this but you will not sleep yeah i'm going to i'm going to make you do this practice one day we'll do that <laughs> but let's see the how it how good it works huh? <laughs> so you will begin like this a very strong <laughs> and then you pray and then and you pray and then, and then lord 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 then what happened your your hands your hands are here under your outfits here you take the support so this is how it comes at the end wonderful whatever it may be we pray to god Now the question is, when we pray, do you think the holy men are present? When we pray, do you think the holy men and the holy men are present there? The holy men and their souls, the spirits of the holy men are present there when we pray. Do you think so? Pradhan Jai said, Apadu Parishuddhula Yokka Atma Lumanta Ontiya. Some people believe this, okay? when we pray the spirits of the holy men those the holy men who are alive and the holy men who are dead their souls will be with us when we pray to support us that's what some people believe manam prarthana chesina appudu evaru untaru ata bratikunna vari chanipoyina vari yokka parishuddhula aatmalu mantho undi mana prarthanal dwara vallu maaku inka prarthan cheyadaniki support chestaru ata కొంతమంది నమ్మే విశ్వాసం ఇది బట్ దట్స్ నాట్ బిబ్లికల్ దట్స్ నాట్ రైట్ ఇట్స్ ఎ రాంగ్ కాన్సెప్ట్ పీపుల్ హ్యావ్ ఓకే అది జరగదు అది జరిగే పని కాదు తప్పు విషయం బట్ ప్రజలు కొంతమంది నమ్ముతారు ఇఫ్ యూ ఫైండ్ అవుట్ సమ్ పీపుల్ లైక్ దాట్ టెల్ దెమ్ డోంట్ డూ దాట్ వాట్స్ ద లాస్ట్ పాయింట్ క్రిస్టియన్ ఫెస్టివల్స్ రైట్ వీ విల్ ఎండ్ అప్ విత్ దిస్ వీ విల్ క్లోజ్ విత్ దిస్ యా వీ జస్ట్ హ్యావ్ టెన్ మినిట్స్ నౌ యా విల్ కంప్లీట్ the christian festivals that's the last point easter pentecost epiphany christmas. and christmas justin the person called justin used the word sunday justin used the word sunday for the day for christians to worship together J U S T I N Justin Justin ane peru gala vyakti Christavulu aadivaram devunu sanidhilo aaradhinchukovali ani aina start chesadu aadivaram man raaskovadu sunday ane raaskondi Justin ane vyakti Christavulu andaru sunday devunu sanidhilo aaradhinchukovali anedi aina cheppadu madhuri sari ga aina cheppadu atla aa maatna atanu use chesadu sunday what do you understand by that word sunday you divide it into two parts sun 
plus day, right? Sunday. Put that this side and that side. The day of the sun. Day of the sun. Sunday. It's a nature. Nature. It's a day, you know, in nature worship. Nature worship. But actually, Justin used it in a different way. Malachi chapter 4 verse number 2. Okay, Malachi chapter 4 verse number 2. Bible says, Son of righteousness. Okay. Our God was called the Son of righteousness. Son, S-U-N, Son. He is a Son of righteousness. And when you come to John chapter 9 verse number 5, we see he is the light of the world. Why is it called sun? Sun is Suryudu. Day is called Suryuni. Why is it called the name of the Shapal? In the name of the Malakki, in the name of the Shapal, what is the name of the Shapal? Oh yeah, Neeti Suryudu. Yeah, Suryudu is there. Yes. Suryudu is there. So, Neeti Suryudu. Prabhu Guru. Son of Righteousness, right? Neeti Suryudu is there. Prabhu Guru is there. Suryudu is there. Then, when you come to Yohan Suvar, you will come to Yohan Suvar. You will come to Yohan Suvar. You will come to the light of the world, it says. And so, again, when we go to the creation story, the first day what God has created, the light. The first day when he was creating, before he was creating, before he created anything, he has created the sun. He said, let there be light. So, that's the first sun. So, he was thinking about all these things. He was thinking about all these things and said, oh, anyway, sun is matching for Jesus. So let's let's worship the Lord, though house churches it may they might be house churches, but let's worship the Lord on Sunday because He is the Sun, He is better than Sun, and yeah, He is better than Sun. It's not just a Sun; He's better than Sun. So let's worship the Lord on Sunday. <laughs> so that's how Justin used that word actually in the beginning. And they, before that, they used to worship the Lord on Saturday, right? Sabbath, Saturday. Sinvaru Aradhan Jai Sevar Apurki, Visranta Dhenum Kadani. But Visranta Dhenum Aradhan Chanum Gadu Asalu, Sanna Nedi Devun Ki Gurtu Gaundi. So, Sunday Manu Aradhan Jai Skunda. Aine Neetu Suryudu, Ane Halochin Dhees Kocchi, Justin. Adi Start Jai Inchad. And people used to fast for two days. In a week, Monday and Thursday, in those days. And slowly Christians have changed it into Wednesday and Friday. Yeah, Christians have changed it into Wednesday and Friday. So even today we have Wednesday Bible study, Friday fasting prayer something. Apatlo Swamvaram, Mangalvaram. Swamvaram, Guruvaram, Aradhan Jeskonavar, Prabhu ki yudulu. उपवास प्रार्थना लो, क्राइस्ट ओल्ड दानी मार्ची, बुधवारों, शुक्रवारों चेस सर, बुधवारों बाइबल स्टडी, शुक्रवारों उपवास प्रार्थनों, स्त्रील कोट को ये दो, अलाव दानी मार्चेर, दैट्स गुड एक्चुअली नो प्रॉब्लम, ज्यूविश पीपल they used to celebrate Passover. You know that, right? <clears throat> Jewish people used to celebrate Passover on 14th of the month of Nisan. The month was called Nisan. N-I-S-A-N, Nisan. Nisan Masun Lo. Padnalgo Tariku. Nisan Masun Lo, Padnalgo Rojuna. Ayudlu, Pasca Pandagan Acharis Tundevar. In 14th of the month of Nisan, Jewish people used to observe, celebrate Passover festival. Slowly, of course, they celebrate it very grand. They used to, they used to wish each other happy Passover. Okay, happy Christmas and Manala Japundama. They used to wish each other as happy Passover. 
they used to celebrate it very happily. But uh, the, the following Sunday, when they celebrate Passover, the following Sunday, Christians made it as Easter. Easter. People, Christians made it as Easter. On the following Sunday after the Passover. So that is how, uh, that is how the, the Easter has observed in Alexandria, in Rome. The Sunday following the Jewish Passover. Now you write down one sentence. Easter, Christianity's oldest and greatest festival. Easter anedi, Christ the Holy Yoka, Atyanta Puratanamaina, Atyanta Ganamaina, Panduga. Easter, Christ the Holy Yoka, Atyanta Puratanamaina, Atyanta Ganamaina, Panduga. Easter, Christianity's oldest and greatest festival. You are going to get this point in your exams, remember. Easter, the Christianity's oldest and greatest festival. In those days, that's what they used to do. So, Easter comes on Sunday, so that previous Friday they used to celebrate as Good Friday, they used to actually fast and pray. There was no Good Friday thing, but they used to celebrate it as a fasting day. Easter Yoka wa Adivaran ki Mundoche Sukruvaran, Ufuas denanga Pratinchkoni, Jerpkone Walu, first the morning and evening work of Jerpkone. Up to Good Friday system Adiledu, Kani, Sukruvar, Ufas Pradan like Pitkun, World Jerpkone were. You know, gradually. The, the Easter festival has lengthened. Easter Pandaka Mundun at twenty, Upasali, Vani, Emipani, Purginsapani, Baga. Baga Purginsapati, you know, actually the, the festival was lengthened so much. How much you know it, right? So, so from it was, it used to be on Friday, Friday, and then slowly later on, they used to celebrate two days. And then they used to celebrate one week and then slowly it came to 40 days. <laughs> now we have the name Lent. Lent and a pair pet koni putmano in rose just now and alapay rosul just on now. Our rose na Easter Pandaka Zerthana Sunday. So it was lengthened actually as the, day, as the days go by. Actually it was just on that day and then Friday only. Usually Easter day is the day of baptisms, right? Today, even now. Easter day is the day of baptisms. <laughs> Many people take baptism on the Easter day because 40 days they prepare. They prepare their souls, you know, they, their spiritual life they prepare. And then on the, on the Easter day they take baptisms. Now come to the Pentecost, Jewish Pentecost festival. What is the meaning of Pentecost? 50, right? 50. After the Passover, after the Passover, 50 days they count and they celebrate Pentecost festival. Pascha Pandaka Tarvata, Pascha Pandaka Nunchi, Yave Rosal Lekka. Yave Rosal Lekka. Yem Pandaka, Pentecost Pandaka. Pentecost and Yabi and Ardo. Pentecost, 50. So, Passover from Passover, they count 50, and the fifth, uh, on that day, they celebrate the Passover. I mean, they, they, they celebrate Pentecost. Next sentence you write down. Pentecost became the second great Christian festival. Pentecost became the second great Christian festival. Pentecost Pandaga, Christ the Ulyoka, Rendava Atyanta Goppa Pandugaga Marindi. 
మొదటి గొప్ప పండుగ ఏం చెప్పా ఈస్టర్ రైట్ ఓల్డెస్ట్ అండ్ గ్రేటెస్ట్ ఫెస్టివల్ నవ్ ద సెకండ్ గ్రేటెస్ట్ క్రిస్టియన్ ఫెస్టివల్ ఈజ్ ఫెంటకాస్ట్ దే యూస్ టు సెలబ్రేట్ ఇట్ యాజ్ అ వెరీ బిగ్ ఫెస్టివల్ అండ్ లేటర్ ఆన్ టూ మోర్ ఫెస్టివల్స్ ఫర్ యాడెడ్ ఫర్ ఫర్ సో మ ఫర్ ఫర్ టిల్ నవ్ హౌ మెనీ ఫెస్టివల్స్ టూ ఈస్టర్ అండ్ ఫెంటకాస్ట్ అండ్ లేటర్ ఆన్ టూ మోర్ ఫెస్టివల్స్ దే హ్యావ్ యాడెడ్ థర్డ్ వన్ ఈజ్ ఎపిఫనీ ఐ హ్యావ్ రిటర్న్ ఆన్ ద బోర్డ్ ఎపిఫనీ ఈపిఐ పిహెచ్ఎన్వై జనవరి సిక్స్ ఓకే ఎపిఫనీ జనవరి సిక్స్త్ అండ్ దెన్ లేటర్ లాస్ట్ ఫెస్టివల్ డిసెంబర్ ట్వంటీ ఫిఫ్త్ షుడ్ ఐ టెల్ యూ ద నేమ్ ఆఫ్ ద ఫెస్టివల్ డిసెంబర్ ట్వంటీ ఫిఫ్త్ ఇట్స్ గోయింగ్ టు కమ్ వెరీ వెరీ సూన్ ఐఎమ్ రెడీ యాక్చువల్లీ నో వన్ న్యూ క్రైస్ట్ రియల్ బర్త్డే రైట్ యా నో వన్ నోస్ ద రియల్ బర్త్డే ఆఫ్ క్రైస్ట్ so the epiphany <clears throat> what festival the festival of appearance of jesus okay epiphany was the festival of the appearance of jesus jesus christ appeared to human beings how many times he appeared he appeared from heaven to the earth right like he became a man he became a boy and then he appeared at baptism at his baptism as the son of god so they they remember all those things and they celebrate epiphany this is about the appearances of christ let's celebrate a festival about christ's appearances aina tanannu taanu bail parchukunna danni batti pandaga cheskundam devudu man manaku tanannu taanu bail parchukunnadu aa panduga bail parchukonina panduga epiphany devudu tanannu bail parchukonina panduga adi ఆయన మనకి బాప్తిష్టం దగ్గర దేవుని కుమారుడిగా పరిచయం అయ్యాడు కాబట్టి దాన్ని సెలబ్రేట్ చేసుకుందామని వాళ్ళు దాన్ని ఎపిఫని అనే మూడు ఫెస్టివల్గా దాన్ని సెలబ్రేట్ చేసుకున్నారు హౌ మెనీ ఫెస్టివల్స్ సో ఫార్ ఫోర్ ఫోర్ ఓకే ఫిఫ్త్ వన్ నా వీజ్ ఎ సెయింట్స్ డే సెయింట్స్ యా సి ఏ a saints day s c i n t apostrophe s saints parishuddhul right saint ante parishuddhul a saints day parishuddhul panduga bhoomi meda unnanta varaku evaru parishuddhul kaadu right avaleru poorthiga parishuddhul avaru ippudu avtaru chani poyinaaka aatma laga tayarai poyinaaka parishuddhul you know nobody can become a saint as long as they live because we cannot be 100% holy with this body in in this world we cannot be a saint when once we are dead yeah we will be spiritual we will not be bodily we will be spiritual and then we can call ourselves as what holy a saint so the saints day means you understand what it is samadhul pandaga yeah saints day people celebrate it as a saints day you know polycarp right i told you the bishop of smyrna polycarp they came to polycarp as a polycarp you are you are believing christ so much we are going to kill you if you don't deny him polycarp nu devuni endu baage ekkuga bai bhaktulu unchutunna vaina endu bai bhaktulu unchadu nu maanakapothe ninnu champestam you know how are we going to kill you we are going to burn your body ne shiriranni mottam mem em chestam kaalchi parestam polycarp said <clears throat> 86 years i have served him how many 86 years i have served him he never left me he never left me how can i bless him my king who saved me that's what he said indirectly what he was telling kill me i don't care 
ఏం చెప్పాడు ఆయన వదిలిపెట్టబోతే చంపేస్తాం పాలి కార్ప్ అంటే ఏమన్నాడంటే ఎనభై ఆరు సంవత్సరాలు నేను ఆయన సేవ చేశాను ఎనభై ఆరు సంవత్సరాలు నేను ఆయన్ని వెంబడించాను ఎప్పుడు కూడా ఆయన నన్ను విడిచిపెట్టలేదు ఇప్పుడు నా రక్షకుడు నేను ఎట్లా నన్ను రక్షించి నా రక్షకుడు నేను ఎలా విడిచిపెడతాను మీరు అడిగినందుకు అని వాళ్ళకి జవాబు చెప్పాడంట ఇంకొక మాటలో చెప్పాలంటే ఏమంటున్నాడు ఆయన చంపి పడేసుకోండి నాకేం ఆయన నేనేం దాని విషయంలో ఏం బాధపడలేదు అని చెప్పాడు వా వీ నీ టు బీ వీ నీ టు థ్యాంక్ గాడ్ ఫర్ పాలి కార్ప్ హే మ్యాన్ సో హీ ఆన్ దట్ ఇయర్ ఆన్ దట్ ఇయర్ ఆన్వర్డ్స్ పీపుల్ యూస్ టు సెలబ్రేట్ సైన్స్ డే కెన్ బీ యు నో ఇట్ కెన్ బీ ఏ ఇన్ మెమరీ ఆఫ్ పాలి కార్ప్ ఇట్ కెన్ బీ ఏ మెమరీ ఆఫ్ పాలి కార్ బట్ we cannot exactly say but they used to celebrate a saints day from that year onwards oh i i'm happy about this thing 156 that year means 156 80 156th century nunchi ee saints day anedi prajalu celebrate cheskuntu vastunaru polycarp chanipoyina sandarbham ga jarpukuntunnaru ani nenu cheppalenu kani oka vela adi adi kuda kavachchu కానీ ఏదేమైనా ఆ సంవత్సరంలోంచి నూట యాభై ఆరవ క్రీస్తు శాఖ నూట యాభై ఆరవ సంవత్సరంలో నుండి ఆల్ సైన్స్ డే ఫెస్టివల్ జరుగుతూ ఉంది సమ్మదుల పండుగ హౌ మెనీ ఫెస్టివల్స్ సో ఫార్ ఫైవ్ నెంబర్ వన్ వాట్స్ ద ఫస్ట్ అండ్ ఓల్డెస్ట్ అండ్ గ్రేటెస్ట్ ఫెస్టివల్ ఈస్టర్ ద యూస్ టు సెలబ్రేట్ సో దాట్ టైమ్ దేర్ వాస్ నో క్రిస్మస్ ఫెస్టివల్ అండ్ నెక్స్ట్ వన్ హెంటకాస్ట్ the festival called pentecost <coughs> they used to join with the jewish people right they were delivered from egypt but we are delivered from sin kind of thing and third one epiphany yeah epiphany what's the meaning the festival of yes Christ appeared himself at the baptism as the real son of God. He appeared as son of God only from baptism, only on that day. They heard the voice, he is my son. So, remembering that appearance, they celebrate Epiphany. That's the third festival. Fourth one, Christmas. They used to celebrate Christmas. December 25th. Okay, the fifth one. saints day or all saints day whatever you can call it so these are the i mean anyway this is a history right general history of christianity so i'm just bringing one by one from the from the textbook that we have so anyway anyway this is very useful history is very useful i want you to learn and understand because this is very and it's a big blessing for all of you to know all these things andar telusukoleri vishayalanni devudu manaku telichesina appudu ivanni nerchukodam manchidi charitra idantha let's pray <coughs> let's pray our heavenly father thank you for this class we are blessed today in the class help us to remember these things in our minds help us that we know more about the general history of christianity in the days to come bless all of us with the knowledge thank you for this class in jesus holy name we pray amen, amen. somebody clean the board thank you